Hello, this is Christian from MakeUseOf.com and in this video we're looking at the Huawei P8 which comes with an interesting 5.25 inch floppy disk drive style case, a 64 bit chipset and a couple of free apps. We're reviewing and giving away the single SIM version of the P8 with LTE high speed mobile networking. A 5.2 inch 1080 by 1920 pixel Gorilla Glass 3 display sits on a 5 0.08 ounce body and although the phone is comfortable to hold with its quarter inch width and 5.7 by 284 inches along the other dimensions it is a mix of a plastic back and metal sides in an age of unibody smartphones and tablets the plastic back is quite a surprise with the end result a light phone that doesn't feel quite as impressive as Huawei would probably like internal storage on this device is 16 gigabytes with 3 gigabytes of system RAM, while the micro SD slot is expandable up to 1 to 8 gigabytes. The user interface is problematic. Huawei has essentially cloned iOS for the phone's Emotion UI. And viewing the settings screen or opening a menu aside, everything closely resembles iOS, even down to the lack of a separate app drawer. With the default iOS theme, the result is an experience that feels like Android but looks like iOS. And if you don't much like the sound of this, the P8 comes with a single alternative theme, inspired not by Android, but by Windows Phone. No, really. As a camera, the Huawei P8 produces crisp images with its 12 megapixel main camera, although the colour reproduction is a little paler in tests. The photos themselves are impressive, however. Huawei has packed some good camera software into Emotion, and taking selfies that make you look absolutely fabulous is so easy with its beautification options. With strong benchmarking results, this is a workhorse of a phone that is comfortable recording video, gaming, streaming video, or just being a phone. Unfortunately, the battery struggles to make it through a full day, although there is a useful low battery mode that can be activated. The finish betrays the P8's true price. A nice phone that is surprisingly slick and easy to use if you don't mind the Emotion UI, the time will soon come when Huawei are able to mass produce a genuine high-end flagship. The P8 gives a good flavour of just what that might be like, but delivers this through a user interface that die-hard Android lovers will probably prefer to avoid. Be sure to head over to MakeUseOf.com to read the full review and see how you can win your own Huawei P8 Android smartphone.